Hello team, I'm out and about in the snow at the moment in Cologne, very cold. Um, here's part two of how to get your music on Spotify playlist for free. Okay, so this is part two of uh, the video series. If you wanna check out part one, I'll link it above somehow. There'll be a little call out happening now. Um, that is where I introduce you to the website we are currently using. And yeah, let's get into part two. This is where we can also utilize the power of follow gates to get added onto more and more playlists and start building a very handy contact list uh, for all future releases. So I'm heading back to my apartment because it is freezing and let's get into part two. Yeah. So by using daily playlists and confirming all those follow gates, what it has done within your Spotify profile is made you follow a whole bunch of new playlists, right? Heaps and heaps of new playlists um, from all your follow gates that you approved by using daily playlists. Where this is really cool, okay? A lot of them have details up the top, as you can see here. Uh, this is the future of rock music submissions and there's a website. Right, all these have information up here. Submit to our playlists, follow this light, um, loft music, this light official. So what we're gonna do is, we're going to start and create a small um, contact list, okay? So it's really important to um, keep record of how you submit songs to their playlists in the future. Also, always keep a link to their Spotify profile. And this is important because as you're writing to them, you want to, instead of saying, hey, here's my new song, put it on your playlists. That's a little bit rude and a little bit unprofessional. You want to click on their profile link and you want to ask them if your song can be added to a specific playlist because it proves that you have viewed their profile and that you sort of take your music submission seriously, okay? The most success I have with getting on playlists is by speaking to people via Instagram. So if they have their Instagram linked, definitely add it. So here, let's use this one for example, this light. So we all already have their Instagram, which is uh, this light official. And then we also have the link to submit www follow this lights.com and then their profile link so they're created by loft music this this light official i'm just going to quickly copy their profile link and add it to my contact list okay and what that allows me to do is when i'm submitting to their playlists uh if you make that a, a link like this now what I can do in the future, if I'm not on Spotify and I'm just using my contact list, I can quickly open Insta uh, Spotify, sorry, and I can see all their playlists and I can write to them, like I said before, and say, um, hey, follow this light music. I love your um, playlist of Discovery Chill 2. I would love my new song to go on your playlist. So that's very specific and they will generally accept that because it's a very specific um, request. Now, as you go down the list, we can see, look, there's email addresses. There is, uh, yeah, another email address here. Uh, what have we got here? Another um, submit portal. So a website to, to list down. So what we want to be doing is adding all these details into a contact list like I have on the side of my screen. Uh, some, for example, like this one doesn't have any details. So through daily playlist, you had subscribed to their playlist. So if this playlist is no use to you, you can unfollow it if you want to. Um, but you can go through, look, 10 stepsofficialcom forward slash promo. You can add that to your contact list. This one doesn't really have any details. So you can unfollow it, get it out of your sort of contacts. And then you can just go through, through, through and really, really narrow down a very, very good um, contact list for you to use in the future. Now, I'm gonna give you an example of writing to someone on Instagram. So I'm just gonna quickly find a account that has an Instagram attached. So here we go. There's one here, Trance 2021, Dreamland by Natalie Yoya. 
Uh, you can see that it's regularly updated by Natalie Gioia. That will be her Spotify profile link or an Instagram link. Perfect. A lot of followers on this one, so a good chance she might not reply. Let's check this other one. Perfect, 103 followers only on this. So what you're going to do, you're gonna give that playlist a, you're gonna give that account a follow, very important. What I then do is I make sure that I have the playlist playing. Just gonna pause the video right here, guys. I hope you're learning something. What I've noticed with my YouTube statistics is many of you are not subscribed to my channel. So if you've learned something or you want to learn more in the future, just hit that little subscribe button. I'm trying to get to 600 subscribers by the end of 2021. So you can help me achieve that goal. All right, let's get back into it. So I have found the account on my smartphone. What I'm going to do, I'm going to send them a DM. I'm going to say, hey team, exclamation mark. I'm then going to take a picture of the playlist. And then I'm going to say, uh, amazing playlist. And then I'm going to say, uh, send. Then I'm going to say something like, how can I get my music on your playlist? How can I get my music onto your amazing playlist? And then you can go two different ways. You can go for the aggressive approach and send your link directly in Instagram chat, or you can do the polite thing and wait for their reply. I generally wait for their reply because I feel like it's more polite instead of forcing, 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 but everyone's different. So you can, you can force it on them or you can wait for their reply and start up a nice conversation. What you can then also do in your um, contact list is you can then color code things. So for example, I might send a DM Instagram to this light official. And what we might find is they might uh, reply instantly um, through Instagram and accept. So you can then just highlight that they are most responsive through Instagram. Maybe uh, they're more uh, inclined to tell you to submit through the website. So you then make the website the sort of green emphasis. Uh, and then you could possibly, once you've submitted to the website, you could then back it up with an Insta DM. Hey guys, just submitted my track through your website, hoping to get onto your playlist called whatever, you know, and then it becomes really personal. You're also creating a, a good friendly relationship with them as well. So guys, I hope this helps you with your musical endeavors and getting on playlists. Thanks for sticking around this long guys. Leave a like on the video if you learned something. Also add a comment, comment on like the most interesting thing you learned or something you never even thought you had to do. I'm sure there's something that you haven't done before that I just mentioned, okay? Leave a comment, let other people know, give the video a like or share it on socials, whatever. I'm out, see you soon. Boom.